Hi, my name is Lingus, and today I'd like to talk to you about uniconduit uterus and how it can also lead to a recurrent miscarriage. So uniconduit uterus, by its name, we can already tell that it only has a single uterine horn instead of two. A normal uterine uterus has two uterine horns. So this type of uh, uterine malformation only presents itself in a one singular horn, so it has a slightly smaller shape as well. So this type of uterine malformation also has an imbalance in the tissue composition meaning there is more connective tissue compared to muscular tissue, uh, which means there is very poor blood flow in the uterine cavity. During a pregnancy, this is especially dangerous because the fetus will not have uh, sufficient nutrients or oxygen to grow the, uh, properly, which may lead to a recurrent miscarriage or a embryonic demise. So because of the small size of this uniconduit uterus, the fetus also has very limited space for it to grow and develop healthily especially towards an advanced stage of pregnancy where there is very little space for it to expand. So for diagnosis in Anta Hospital, we will apply our standard hysteroscopy and hysterosalpingography, which is an x-ray imaging of the uterus, and lastly, a 4D color Doppler ultrasound to accurately assess the shape and size of this uterus and confirm whether or not there is a malformation. So once there is, uh, it is confirmed and identified, Anti Hospital will proceed with our standard uterine expansion surgery to expand this uniconduit uterus into a healthy and normal uh, size of a uterus to, to help you secure a healthy pregnancy. Now, if you'd like to find out more details about this type of malformation and its treatment, please refer to the article below.